don't know where I'm going. I said, that's okay, they'll tell you where you're going. That kind of learning was the focus Wednesday at JCPS elementary schools. Learning where they're going in the hallways, how to distance in the lunchroom, and what new protocols are in place. But it was also a day to celebrate being together. There's so many things that they can't learn just on a computer. They need that social interaction with each other. So we're excited that they're gonna be able to get to see each other and be able to really work together. Teachers are focusing on relationships and social emotional learning. They've talked over a computer and kept up the academic side of learning, but now students and teachers have the chance to spend all day together and learn more about each other. They've had curriculum all year long. We've done a knockout job on NTI with giving kids lots of assignments and standards-based learning, but they haven't had each other, so I think that is our main focus for everybody. It wasn't an easy time for teachers, students, or parents. Today's return to class was a much welcomed and joyous occasion. I think the kids and teachers and everybody persevered and normalcy is coming back. Tomorrow, kindergarten through fifth grade students in Group B, plus all elementary special education students will be back in school. For WHAS 11 News, I'm Rose McBride.